Standing on this mountain top, looking just how far. I believe the the reason women come back every year is because they're thirsty. They're hungering and thirsting for the word of God and for the encouragement of each other. I think sometimes as fast-paced women of this world, we don't have time to slow down and and remember that uh, you know that we need to be God-centered. It's a special time that women can bond together and just be together to help lift each other up in praise and to grow spiritually and just have fellowship, which is so wonderful, women, women together having fellowship. My favorite part of conference is just being able to spend time with family and my family and God. I enjoy the fellowship and it gives me a lot of encouragement. I get to meet a lot of people people from different states. You can laugh and play and pray and fellowship with other women who love the Lord and want to grow. It's a wonderful environment where we as women can come together and share God's Word and be inspired and just have a great time. To be together with a lot of Christian women um, and just learn a lot. Um, just from, from other women and their experiences. I think if you could sum up all of Scripture, that would be it. Everything is for the glory of God, so that the nations will know Him, so that they will see Him. God, you are faithful. How do you not come? It's the best investment you can make. For two days, you're going to cry, you're going to laugh, you're going to interact, you're going to have great food, great fellowship. So, this is so fun. Well, uh, as you can see, the pizza's on the table. And, um, I love being in a place where women come together under the same roof. I think the singing, is, it's got to be like heaven. It's just got to be like heaven. You are faithful, God, you are People just being so humble and open with their lives, being able to relate. I don't have to hide and be ashamed and um, feel guilty. The conference is really well worth the time and the money to be with other women of our faith and to hear their story. I think we are so hungry for real. We, we just long to have Jesus with skin on and faith with feet and to be able to share that. The stories that were told um, just really spoke to my heart in a way that I, surprised me. Things that um, we all have secret lives. Uh, secret hurts, habits, hang-ups, and I, I was just astonished at how they spoke to those things. It was wonderful to have the opportunity to speak and join in uh, with the conference. It was everything I'd heard about. I've heard so much about it, and it was everything and more. It's about he and I, it's about you and I, and it's about where I am with him, period. There's nothing like it, and unfortunately, you don't know it until you're here because you just think, oh great, another conference, how good can it be? But it's, it's just like feeding the 5,000. You come hungry, and you leave filled. And what would you give in exchange for that? So I would tell a woman she is worth whatever it takes to get her soul filled, to get her heart encouraged, to connect with other women. We need more of that on a real basis. It just gives you so much hope and joy and fulfillment in your life and gives you so much to look forward to. You should come to Women Walking with God because you will be spiritually uplifted like nothing you've ever felt before. It is worth it. Do it. It's, it's awesome.